the total loss comes 762 million on this contract. Because now the chairman is coming here asking me things which bring me nuts what? The Public Accounts Committee is one of the oversight committees that investigate reports of the Auditor General on accountability in government. Chaired by opposition MP Nandara Mafavi, it has been one of the most influential and hardworking committees, according to parliamentary reports. <laughs> Receiving the award for fighting corruption this morning, the Dadi West MP said the committee has aided government to recover 1.4 trillion shillings in the last two years, following stringent investigations from public officials guilty of stealing public funds. On average, over 700 billion is being returned. You have heard that there's a problem of absorption capacity in the government. Why? It's simple. Those days, people would give contracts to anyhow, and the people would steal money. We should not only praise those who have been able uh, to get and amass wealth uh, through corruption, but we should also be able to single out those who have been able to fight. That is why the Africa have unanimously chosen him to be the overall integrity award winner 2010. In the race of political leadership, Honorable Nanda Ramafavi, you were with the, the, the president of this nation as second to, to, to you. <laughs> this is my salary with my committee. However, despite the recognition, members of PAC still cite numerous challenges in the course of their work. The pressures will very often try to tear apart the members so that what you are driving collapses. I want you, the civil society, not to stop thanking Honorable Nandala Mafabi and the committee, but to demand for the implementation of these reports. The Africa Challenge Foundation is an NGO that was founded by universities and tertiary institutions in the country. Agnes Nandutu, NTV Tonight.